Look at me go! Look at me go! <laughs> yeah, I'm safety. <laughs> oh my god! She fired! No! No! Yeah. Vader, you can suck a fat one. Take this grenade. I sucked ass. I my whole What's up guys, it's Steve with Hap Gaming, and welcome back to another Trover Saves the Universe video. This is part four. Uh, if you remember the last part, we just finished Shroomy World and got ourselves a cauldron full of uh, Glorcon guts. Oh, I never saw that poster. She got like dog, ear dog ears too. Does Trover have? No, Trover doesn't have any dog ears. Um, yeah, so now we're going to go to the voodoo person with the bucket full of guts. People here. This is scary, partner. This is weird. Let's. Ah, welcome. I'm Voodoo Person. I'm gonna take your receptacle and enchant it with science and things. But I need a favor from you, please. Set the vessel down in front of me, please. Drop the vessel with all the Glorcon goo inside of it. Set it down in front of me. Ah, good work. Right where I asked you to place it, right in the spot. Or close enough. Thank you very much. I need you to go to... There's a cursed village. The villagers' souls are tormented <laughs> in everlasting pain. And they must be freed from their bodies to once again know peace. They walk the area of their village aimlessly, endlessly, and for eternity in pain and torment. Okay, all right, what do you want us to do? You have to go to the villagers and and kill them, slay them, so their spirits will be free. You want to kill a village. And they can once again know peace fr from the pain and torment that they are eternally living in because they've been cursed. Partner, what do you think? Come on, partner. We got to do this. Uh, otherwise, we're, you know, the game is stop stopped. It's halted. I don't even know why I asked you. All right. Okay. Thank you. We'll be back. All right. Good luck, That's you two. Up. And uh, while you're gone, I'll be hard at work enchanting. Voodoo person wants me to kill a bunch of people, Ricky. Glorcon clone juice. And getting it all primed and ready I mean, for the Well, I mean, Trover said I had to Your do it because the, the game will continue I'm in the if I know. Don't do it. I'm all looped in with the, what's going on. Good luck. Have fun. Don't have too much fun. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Oh, 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 my stomach. Oh, I feel the rumbling oh, from all the sticks that I put up inside of my anus hole. God damn it. Oh, 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 oh my stomach's a rumbling. Oh, 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 I'm just gonna stay here and get these sticks out. Uh, uh, I don't know how they got there. Uh, uh, oh, 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 my stomach. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Weird. All right. Apparently, we're going to Vanilla Village now. I can't believe we're killing these people, but I will say, at least we're getting to do it under this beautiful green sky, and the ground is sort of orangey, and the little their little houses are circular and orange. It's pretty. I mean, I do like. I do appreciate that. They are super. Why would I do this? Hey, partner, maybe we should scope this place out before we kill anybody. You know, these villagers don't seem possessed. And on to Vanilla Village. Only got ten of them here, huh? Okay. This is Enos Bilson. 
Want to take uh, take in a show? Hut Builder, the musical is playing at. Oh, <laughs> that's a sh Hut Builder. The musical is playing at Vanilla Village Theater. Yeah. They, they, they seem fairly put together. I don't want to kill these people. So yeah, I killed like. You know, partner, you know, we don't have to kill these villagers. I mean, we'll still get the enchanted cauldron and all that stuff. But he said I had to kill him. Whoa! This is Fingo Funker. Don't forget to take a tour of the Vanilla Village Farm. The sample and sample some of our famous boiled pickled potatoes. Mm. So consistent. You just got another green power, baby. Dude, you are making my day. Oh, there's one there. Another green power. Uh, this is Lamar Utter. Manila Village can be tough to navigate, but don't worry. Giving directions is our favorite pastime. Baby, you, what are you, Mother Teresa over here? <laughs> what a good guy. I see one there. I see it. Come All right, you got a green. Uh, let's see. This is Martha B. Mar Bartha. Uh, while here, be sure also to check out Vanilla Village's Remembrance Rock, the rock that pays homage to the other rock. Power baby. Homage. No homage, isn't it? I said homage. What the fuck is wrong with me? There's another power baby. Now that's what I'm talking This is Struder. In the mood for some worldly culture? Check out the empty bin exhibit happening now at Vanilla Village Art Museum. Talking about green power baby. <laughs> this is milk. Did we mention we have the world's smallest waiting room? The bitch was hiding pretty good. You got it. Hank, Vanilla Village has tons of sporting events for all you fanatics out there, including the Serenity Staring Contest, Feather fe uh, Volleyball, and Monotone Humming. Our baby's hiding in the fucking bushes! Another one there. Miffin Hilltop. While visiting Vanilla Village, be sure to check out Dry Dan's Driest Dry Cleaning. It's dry. Oh, babies. Why are they so hard to find? Good work. I see one over there. I see one there too. Good. I was worried we're gonna have to kill everybody to get the lost power, baby. Good work. These fucking green. Bobbert Billfrey. Vanilla Village prides itself in having the lowest crime rate in the cosmos, and even if there is a crime, we won't report it. Power babies, I swear to God. That's the last one. Man, if they made it any harder to find it. Snorky. Welcome to Vanilla Village, home to the world's smallest waiting room. Green power baby. I tell you what, we wouldn't be out here getting them. Yeah, I'm not killing these guys. Would you guys We're kill them? kill any of them? I hope pole. voodoo person doesn't get upset. I mean, that's what we came here for. But whatever, you know, you're you're calling the shots. Let's go back to voodoo person. Oh my god, I can't believe it! I can't believe that I got another hit point. This is my fourth new hit point. I'm so strong now, partner. I'm so strong and I feel so good. Oh shit! You, you managed to get all the green power babies here in this little cursed village. All right, is that all of them? Yeah. Okay. I'm not killing those people, the new person, I'm sorry. I got an achievement for not Ooh, killing everybody, I guess. there's my favorite smell. Oh, I've been jibbling the little swing ever since you two left. Uh, Come on, person, Andy. we actually didn't kill anybody, be any of the villagers, because it just felt weird. They, they, they seemed totally fine. You didn't kill any of the villagers? Oh. oh. 
Their spirits will be trapped as they meander. Oh, and their little rectangular shaped huts that are dark gray and the red piercing blood anybody. red sky of their world. That's what it looked like, right? When you were there, that's what you saw? No? Well, what did it look like then? Uh, they had orange huts and like the sky was green and the ground was sort of orangey and sandy. Oh like my god. Oh, I gave you the wrong coordinates. Oh, you didn't kill anybody. Thank God. That's the village I go to get my dry cleaning done. Oh, thank God you didn't kill anybody. Or else I wouldn't even be able to get any of my dry cleaning stuff done. Okay, here's the vial of Glorcon <laughs> Guts. Uh, Glorcon Clone Guts. You can take that to your... I voodooized it, and I did all a little magic to it. Now the abstainers will be able to use that, but thank God. And they, they do my dry cleaning. They clean my house twice a week. They do my driveway. The they do the uh, all the landscaping. Thank God you didn't kill them. All right, leave me the fuck alone. I'm a voodoo character. I got shit to do. Get the fuck out of my house. Get out of my place. I got shit to do. I'm a voodoo character. All right, let's go. Back to the abstainers. I knew it! I knew there was something wrong about that village! I felt it in my gut! I was like, I don't know about this dude, and you were like, me too! God damn it! Can you believe this shit, partner? I mean, we could have wiped out an entire village because of that idiot voodoo person character with her with her gaping asshole. You probably didn't see it, but when I was running around in there, I saw her gaping giant asshole. <laughs> it was insane! But anyways, we could have killed the village. It's insane we didn't do it, thank God. And now we're and now we're partners here. We're like you're you're a fucking Cherorpion. I'm an eye hole monster. What the fuck is this shit? You know what I mean? We don't. We, we uh, the likes of us don't ever get along in the cosmos. But here we are, an unlikely pairing. God damn, part. We are dialed in. We're a couple of buccaneers. You know? Oh shit! What the fuck's going on? Holy shit! Surprise! It's me, Glorcon, you fucking dumb pieces of shit! Oh my god! Trying to get your dogs back? Not gonna happen. See him in my eyes? They're fucking crying right now. It hurts them to be in my eyes. You guys are fucked. Fuck trying you. to get my Glorcon clone guns? Trying to fucking do one over on me? I don't think so. I'll be taking no. those. Fucking idiots. Can't believe the abstainers thought something this stupid would work. I'm a fucking god with your dogs in my eyes. I'll be right back. I've got a little surprise for you. Oh, while I'm away, look at the beautiful vista of my amazing Glorcon Palace base behind an incredibly powerful shield force field. I intercepted your pod and placed you in a nice spot with good view of my fucking cool base <laughs> of operations on this secret hidden planet. I'll be right back. Holy shit, partner! What the fuck are we supposed to do? Surprise! A little present for you Whoa, guys. What the fuck? You know what it is? It's a fucking bomb! Jesus Christ! The second you arrive at the abstainer's location, it's gonna detonate. And it's gonna kill the three abstainers along with the two of you. Suck my giant Glorcon nuts. I don't wanna do that. You fucking dipshits. Holy shit! Shit, partner! You gotta defuse that bomb! Defuse the bomb! Just do whatever, like hit buttons or figure it out. Uh, I, I, gotta, I gotta reroute the telepod. I gotta override the telepod. He's got us going straight for the abstainers. It's gonna kill the abstainers and, and you and me. Partner, you got, holy shit, it looks just like that damn puzzle from the tree trunk in the Shlemy world, the first level of the game. The fucking impossible puzzle. I thought we weren't gonna do that in this game. I thought I thought we agreed we weren't gonna do those sorts of game mechanics in this game. That's not what this game's about. Jesus Christ. Why would they put another one of these in the game? It's not the fun thing to do in the game. It's not a fun thing to do in a video game. Say hit buttons. It's like a quick time event. Yeah, well, uh, hello, Dragon Slayer from 1985 called. It wants its fucking lame quick time event bullshit. Whatever, who cares? Uh, I got it, I got it. The telepod doors are open. Fuck this bomb. Fuck this shit. I'm fucking this. I'm kicking it out. One, two, and a three right out the fucking telepod door. Look at that fucking thing flying away. I overestimated this Glorcon character. Or maybe I didn't, but whatever. Either way. I'm pretty cemented on the fact that this guy's a fucking moron. Trover, Cherorpion, what happened? Glorcon intercepted the telepod, somehow brought us to his secret base, and 
And then he put a bomb in the telepod, but get this. It was the world's shittiest fucking bomb. You know, it was a fucking piece of shit, you know what I mean? But I, but his intentions were to kill, you know, all of us. You know, me, the, the chair orpian, the three of you. We were all supposed to die. I'm, I'm, I mean, that, that, that much is clear to me. But he's a fucking idiot and he, and he fucking fucked up because he's stupid. And that, and that makes me feel pretty good and comfortable and relaxed. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness gracious. He's past the point of reasoning. He's gone mad. If Glorcon redirected the telepod to his secret base, then that means the telepod has Glorcon's secret base location embedded into it. And we can determine where his secret base is. Trover, Cherorpion, we must engage in a reconnect. It's a very risky and untested maneuver. No one knows exactly what happens when four abstainers get manually reconnected, but one thing is for sure. It will probably strip Glorcon of his agency and almost definitely fold his consciousness back into ours. Most likely. That sounds like some sort of plan. Here are special grab-throw chair upgrade things. Spit on them. Ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> Stop spitting on me. Gross. Normally I'm into getting spit on. You know, it's kind of a turn on, but not by these guys, you know? Not too much of a fan of that. All right, you've just been endowed with the grab-throw chair upgrade. It lets you grab and throw objects wherever you look. Where was this when Glorcon had a bomb strapped to our telepod? Shut your bitch ass up, Trover, before we smack you across the face backhanded like <laughs> pimps do. That's right, we know about pimps. We are summoning four strange creatures. Here they are. These creatures are special. They're the crystallized, large creatures. We only have four. You will need to go and find four more. But for now, I want you to pick these up and throw them into two of our eye holes, connecting two of us. Chair Orpion, you must look at the crystal power, baby, and hold the R2 button to activate this new ability. Do it. Pick them up and throw the creatures into two of our eye holes. Ooh, shit, yeah, oh. That baby's already kicking in. Uh, 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 oh, oh, I want the crystal power babies in my eyes. Do me now. I, I will prefer to wait for the other crystal power babies that you're going to find in the levels. Oh, shit, almost. Try again. Oh, there it is. Throw it into my eyes. Uh, uh, uh. We are now merged. We feel very good. This is very nice. I feel very zen. You must go out and collect four more of the other special creatures. They will need to be plugged into this abstainer. What's up, dudes? It's me, Tyler. And Glorcon. Go now. Go go get the other special creatures. Go. Hurry. Come on. All right, partner. Let, let, let's, let, let's leave them to it. Oh, oh, I'm bummed. I'm all messed up back here. I, I'm all loopy as hell. Lorcon's one a hell of a. Jesus Christ, villain. that one abstainer's all oh, fucked up. Like Listen to him. Kind of makes looks. me want to get drunk. I say I'm we get drunk, I partner. I say we get real place. drunk. Once I'm we finish all this shit, I say we take a shot oh, every I'm level. From not being connected from those creatures. Yeah, I'm a fucking shit show over here. I'm a shit show. I'm a regular old shit show. Oh, you know Partner, that's the boss up. calling. Oh, Go ahead and man. answer it. Hello, Trover, Chair Orpian. You have to collect these special creatures, the crystally ones, that need to be plugged into the abstainer and Glorcon's eye holes. I found the location of a pair of them. They're in Flesh World. Flesh World. What is Flesh World? Well, could be any number of things. I, I truly have no idea. And I, it's not my job to know that. I don't give a shit. All I know is the computer I looked at located the crystal babies and they're in flesh world and I'm gonna make sure the telepod gets you right near where they are so you get out of the telepod on flesh world and you fucking get the crystal babies and let's just keep this horse moving now let's talk a little bit about flesh world what is it is it flesh is it a world why not call it skin world why not call it skin planet I don't know it's not my job to name things I'm the boss of this operation okay now get the fuck out of my sight. I got shit to do. Fucking, I got a homework assignment. I'm doing a crossword puzzle for my for my teacher. I'm taking a night school class. See you guys in Flesh World, or I won't be there, but you know what I mean. Good luck in Flesh World. <laughs> 
man, I am just reeling at how stupid this Glorcon character is, you know? Thinks he's all tough. He might have your dogs plugged into his eyes and have superpowers, but I'll tell you one superpower he doesn't have. The, the superpower of intelligence. He's an idiot. That was the dumbest bomb I've ever seen in my life earlier that he tried to pull. Didn't do nothing. Now all we gotta do is find these crystal babies, and we'll be wrapped- well, This whole thing will be wrapped up real quick, and you'll be back home on your stupid chair place, and I'll be in my place. And we'll have distant memories of each other. Right, partner? You and me. Distant memories. Off to Flesh World. Jesus Christ, this fucking place looks like a cannibal's paradise, you know what I mean? It's probably, it probably stinks really bad over there. Jeez, man, this whole situation's really getting out of hand, you know? It's one thing after the next. Hey, the, the, the source material you guys are made from, you fucking moron! You're all dumb! That's right, everybody. Ricky spraying spray the weeds. And you guys all know. Ricky, you spray the weeds. Those fucking guys. All right, partner, let's get inside this place and get that, get these fucking crystal After babies. After he dog in. All right, let's grab hey, this. Hey, purple uh, guy and Cheropian. Good work, friend. This is Norgel. Complimenting a fella on the street and expecting a thank you is like giving cold lasagna to a homeless man without a fork. No one wants that shit. Get it out of here. Cheropian, come baby. over here. Anything else? Anything hey, over seriously, here? come over here. Man, this place, you know, it's it's all squishy and wet here. There's veins everywhere. Not a fan God, of this it's place. It's bad. wet and gross. That's all I gotta say about it. Damn, you found a This is Hunter Bunce. Pop quiz hot shot. What'd you do if an armed pregnant woman approaches you in a bar holding a deadly bag of beans? Green goddamn power, baby! Good job! There is stupid. Where you are is dumb. Come here. Come here. Now. Oh, these green power babies. Okay, this is Mr. Mystical. This little power baby knows the facts. 95% of middle aged men with ponytails teach Tai Chi. They make my brain shiver. They're also idiots. I'm sorry if you have a ponytail and you're a man. Stop hey, having partner, a ponytail. What do you think of this crazy man. thing, huh? Seriously, to climb up really on top of that dumb. thing and give it a give it a ride around the around this place. You know what I mean? Over here. Come here. Partner, this looks like that upgrade guy from uh from earlier. Let's go see what he wants. Oh, oh, hey, what's going on, bro? I'm Upgrade Teddy. You waiting for the zoo to open too? That place ain't right. My baby bro went in there last week and he never returned. I just hope he didn't forget his heart medication. There's a Bora leg. Have you heard of it? It's the brand doctors trust most of the time. Speaking of time, I've been out here so damn long that I built this game. Wanna give it a go? Here, you're gonna need this power baby upgrade. Oh shit, we got a power baby upgrade, partner. Let's get this puppy installed in me. Yeah, come on, bro. It's free. Take it. Come on, look, grab the power baby. Right there, it's right there. We got, we got to get this thing plugged into my eye, partner. Take it, bro. It's free. I'm Take playing. it. Walk me over to the power baby, partner. Walk me over oh. to the power baby. I needed to bring him to it. Okay. Man, look at these little sons of bitches going at it. Oh my god, this is incredible. You know, if they put this on a sports network, I would watch it. I'd bet money on it. All right, you got the power baby upgrade. It's all installed. Now just hit the triangle button for a new heavy, sweet ass attack move. Press the triangle sweet button to hit the bug in the air. Look at it and press R2, then toss it at the target. Simple fucking shit. Ha ha, there you go. Got it. Hit all the targets and I'll hit you with a prize. Do you think my brother's dead? The zoo's been closed ever since that big ass spaceship showed up. Some big muscly stud muffins locked it up. And that Dang. dumb sexy. We just got two of them, so let's see. This is Christina Binky. 
uh, man thongs and sweatpants are like peanut butter and jelly. You wouldn't think they'd go together, and you're right. They don't. Just my opinion. Okay, so who was the other person I got? I got... I got Singbean. If you restart the game, I'll tell you how to get the, to the bonus level. If it doesn't work the first time, try it again. Yeah, you got a green power, you know, baby! But who cares about a bunch of grade-A buff beefcakes locking up a flesh zoo? I want to get my baby bro, baby bro, baby bro back. I don't know what's going on. I've just been waiting for the zoo to fucking open so I could get my brother out. It's nice to see you guys are playing my game. It looks fun. I haven't even played it. And you missed it. Sure is a beautiful day for standing around watching somebody not accomplish shit. Hey, did I ever tell you about the time me and my baby bro went to the mall? Oh, well, we did, and he tried to jump over the second store railing. I couldn't believe it. I grabbed him on his shirt and caught him just as he was about to go over, all the way down from the second floor. I don't know if you guys know what it's like to stand on a pile of sweaty flesh all day, but that's what I've been doing. And I'd describe it to you, but I just sort of did. Oh, just standing around a pile of sweaty flesh all day. What a treat. Seems really gross. I'm gonna take my pee pee blood and put it in a vial and give it to a doctor. <laughs> you guys didn't need to know that there's blood coming out of my pee pee hole right now. No, I didn't. There's a puddle of pee pee blood by my feet. Don't look down. a bathroom in your telepod? I really need to go number two, but I can't do it with all the blinking eyes and skin everywhere. Hey, look at that. You got them all. You get a free green power baby. Uh, don't you worry about me and those these green power babies. I'm going to take care of those. But first, we got to get inside this zoo. Okay, Shelby Shankle. Uh, what's the 411 with the toilet and the telepod? Is it unisex? Does it come equipped with a bidet? What's the flushing like? Is it dual flushing? The seat, uh, the seat situation. Are we talking cushion? No cushion? Zoo. How are you gonna get in? It's all locked up, stupid dumb. You think this is my first time breaking into a zoo, huh? I break into zoos all the time. I just broke into a zoo last week. Why? For the same reason I do everything. Criskets. I know they got criskets in there, uh, and I'm ready to get back on that horse. Oh man, I had to stop eating those. They kept making me pee blood. Power I wasn't planning on being out here so long. I hope my neighbor is still collecting my mail. It's almost tax time. You know, rumor has it that if you turn this world inside out, it looks like a 45-year-old bank teller. I don't know how we're getting in here. Looks locked to me. Jeez, this place smells like raw chicken that was left in the trunk of a car. Holy shit, Fart. You open the gate. Look for my baby bro. Downgrade, Daddy. Yeah, we'll be sure to keep an eye out for him. Why would I want downgrade, Daddy? We need some help here. Hello? Trova Phillips. Gail? G Gail Jenkins? Wow. Uh, it, it's, it's been a while. It sure has. Dr. Tinkleson. Check out the new reality CBZ show, Undercover Dad. He's he's under the covers again. What's he doing Trover, in there? You look nice with those new power babies in your eyes. Uh, yeah, thanks. W w w what have you been up to, Gail? What does it look like I've been up to, Trover? I'm the head zookeeper of my own goddamn zoo. That's right, I'm keeping this zoo all by myself, and it's my fucking zoo. What have you been up to? Slumming it with a Cherorpion, I see. So what are you, Trover's new roommate? I'm talking to you, Cherorpion. Are you his new roommate? Yes, sir. Oh, well, good for you. 
You got off scot-free in that case. Cause this little son of a bitch will stick you with last month's rent, all the stains on the wall for the cleaning deposit, and a bunch of other things. It doesn't take five nails to hang one picture, Trover. Listen, Gail, we're just here to see the Crystal Babies. Oh, you want to see the Crystal Babies? Well, go by all means on your own little way and find them. I'm sure you couldn't help but notice that the gate to the flesh safari is closed. But I'm not going to help you, Trover. If you were any other one of my zoo guests, I'd give you a lift. But guess what? Fuck you. Now let me get back to what I was doing a second ago. I was counting papers. Thanks, Gail. This definitely okay, is partner, prison, let's right? figure out how to get this fucking flesh safari door open. Cut it out, Trover! You can't hit my little creature! This is- Holy oh. shit, it's a green! Lettuce piss hook. I love it when after, when my deadbeat stepdaughter reminds me that I'm not her real mother. power, baby! Jesus Christ, I can't believe it's fucking my old roommate, Gail. I mean, sure, yeah, I ditched out on some of the rent money, but the guy's fucking insane, I'm telling you. He used to come into my bedroom and just scream of- James McDirty. If you want your son to grow up to be a real man, then you need to teach him the little doo-wop did he dance when he turns 30? About lasagna, for no reason. He was like in a trance, I couldn't even talk to him. This is not good, we gotta get these fucking crystal babies and get the fuck out of here. Green power ba Better biker huggy. Two things you need to know about me. My best friend is my dad, and I got a hitchhiker named Randy locked in my basement. Baby in the hole! Partner, I'm telling you, this guy's fucking insane. One time he threw a party, said all his best friends were gonna be there. I came out of my room and I talked to people. Nobody knew who he was. I don't know where he found these people. I got the fuck out of there. God fucking damn it, it's a- Deb Deb, laser toe. I don't know about you, but when I get a little cross breeze between my coin purse, I get I get all peachy in the cheeks. Goddamn motherfucking titty sucking two ball bitch green power baby! Oh my god, one time Gail brought home a random baby. He didn't even know who it belonged to. Put it in the sink. I just took off. One time he claimed that the stock photos in his picture frames were people that he sued. Search around some more. everywhere and they weren't even to me they were to non-existent people about things that had happened in the apartment that didn't happen huh i wonder why this gate's locked what's going on here fuck you trover leave the fucking gate alone that's my new roommate's gate okay gail i didn't know you were paying attention to us sorry you got him right i'm paying attention you, Trover. Now I'm back to my little zoo keeping tax work I gotta deal with. So fuck you. Whoa! When he gets really upset, he starts screaming about pizza nuggets, which doesn't make any sense because his father was a pizza nugget. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe, maybe there is a connection and that does make sense. We gotta get the fuck out of here. Drinking his water, he used to eat it, if you know what I mean. And I'm not even talking about that he froze it and fucking chewed on it. I'm saying he would use a fork and a knife and eat water. Unfrozen liquid water. That's who we're dealing with here. Whoa! He caught me rubbing my shingle on his pillow. And the guy never washed the pillow. You'd wash your pillow if you caught someone rubbing their shingle on it. The guy's nuts. 
not sure what a shingle is, but all right. I never once saw him use the bathroom, and I set up four cameras on the bathroom I went just that to nipple be thing to pop 100 percent sure. Never went in there. His room, on the other hand, spent a lot of time in that room, and there were piles of green sludge in there. A lot of green sludge. He used to sleep on a bed of rocks and pipes that he found in the sewer. One time I came home and I saw him standing there rubbing raw turkey dough all over his ass. Who turkey does dough? That? I don't even know what turkey dough is. I guess we'll go open this gate. Hopefully that nipple will be open by then. What? He was obsessed with climbing trees in the buff. Come on. He used to whip his little winger, wingler out and climb trees. Who does that? Clothes had zippers on them, and then and you and he they kept get cutting on the door. Cutting? Did a partner. Good work. Good work, Trover and Cherubian. Opening my zoo park door, and I have fun, and have a good time, and I hope you find my crystal babies and get a good peep at them. This I'm really hoping I can come back here. isn't easy to open. Is, isn't easy to keep open. I'm back to my taxes. All right, Gail. Sorry. Let's go. Come on. We gotta move. your partner i'm getting weird vibes about this place you know we should hurry up and get the crystal babies and get the hell out of here there it is what the fuck, 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 fuck? let's see miss pooper dickle popper that's popper popper dickle i'd be lying if i said this was my first time being trapped in a toilet I'd also be lying if I said I didn't like fuck, it. Fuck, 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 green power, baby! Right. Prison bait! Get me out of this prison! Look at me over here. Hey, hey, come on. Come on, look over here. Listen to me. Hey, hey, come here. You gotta help me out. I shouldn't be here. I'm innocent. I didn't steal all those rakes. They said I stole a thousand rakes. Motherfucker, I don't even know what a rake is. Classic Gale, of course this is a prison. This son of a bitch. He's got a bunch of prisoners in here. All right, let's just get these fucking crystal babies and get the fuck out of here. I told you he was crazy. Shut the fuck hey, up, you purple bag of cuss. I'm here. talking to the chair OP. You gotta help me get out of here! Mr. Gildo. I make taxidermy koala bear pack backpacks for celebrities. They're chic. Chic? Chic. They're chic. Is that how you say that? I don't know. Um, and they keep pickpocketing orphans at bay. Rex Fungler, the only place you'll find sincere compliments anymore in this is in the is in the comics. Ha, 
is in the comment section of a porn video. Hey stranger, over here. My name is Andy DeFrance and I've been wrongfully accused of murder. You have to help me. No, listen, I'm sorry, but you know, we're, we're busy. Fine. I don't need you. I'll escape by crawling through the sewage system. I'm talking three football fields of shit. Ugh, that's disgusting. Yeah, it's gonna get real nasty up in there. Hey, hey, oh, take it off. Okay, Look bye. Look, you gotta get me out of this prison. I don't belong here. I'm innocent. They're claiming that I killed my maid, but I didn't. She just. I'm uh, Junior Miss, just... bitch. Come closer and I'll refresh your mouth. Go, go, hurry. Pissy shit piss. And poop and poo poo and pee and brown bad poop and yellow piss and shit. Poo poo pee. I want all the poop and pee on me and Anything back here? There's a thing right there. Pissy shit piss and poop and poo poo and pee and brown bad poop and yellow piss and shit. Poo poo pee. I want all the poop and pee on me and in me and all the poop and shit and eat my shit after I eat that shit. This is shh burp. Shh I don't know. I enjoy eating PB cuisine. Frozen dinners while watching reruns of the Muscle Man competition. Shit, and I'll poop and pee and shit and eat the shit in your and your poop and your pee. I'm hoping and I can poop just it get out there later on. I, I guess. I want all the shit and piss in the world and the poop. Flush your poop and shit and piss and piss and shit. Yellow God, and brown. God, I need to work that guy. Wow. I what a beautiful lake! How the fuck? Huh, is I wonder what that green here? stuff is. Probably better not to find out. Partner, I'm pretty sure that's the exhibit right up ahead that's gonna have one of those crystal creatures that we need in it. Get the crystal creature and get the hell out of here, you know? Green power, baby! Uh, let's see. Tona B. Vuttonfly. Why isn't there a bigger market for plus, slide, plus size edible underwear? Just makes sense, you know? Can I carry that thing all the way over here, maybe? I can't, because I have to be able to teleport. And I can't see that from over here. There's got to be something else I can grab. What's going on? What the fuck? Oh, ho, ho. Trover, I knew you were coming all along. You play me for a dum-dum? I lived with you for how many oh, years? Wonderful. Here we go. Here we go. You skipped out of my $240 <laughs> rent and uh, whatever bill. And I'm angry with you. So I got in bed with... These chicken nugget characters that I barely know. Oh, those fucking guys. That's right. Gail's in bed with us. Uh, it's Gail. Gail, sorry. Gail's in bed with us. And you're fucked. Remember us? Yeah, fuck you. We're gonna fucking kill your fucking stupid ass. We have amazing train ninja level clone people now. What the fuck have we gotten ourselves into? You got yourself into a real shit pile of fuck. We're sending our toughest karate chop clone fighters in now. Oh, fuck, partner! We gotta deal with this head on! That's right, Trover. You gotta deal with this head on. Cause you're a fucking naked, little purple, whole island monster. And you fucked me for $740. And I won't ever forget it. And I. And God 
God damn it's a coincidence, or was it? Is it a coincidence or is it fate that brought us back together, Trover? Because I was sitting here running my zoo that's all that's also where I live in, and all my little zoo animals, that's not a prison, and then all of a sudden these chicken nugget characters showed up and they said, We need help. And I said, What are you talking about? And they said, Well, there's this character named Trover and them and this Cherubian. And they're showing up to get those crystal babies that you care so much about. And I was like, Wonderful. Here we go. Here we go. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? You're not gonna kill my crystal babies. And they told me that you, that you would get them. And we teamed up and made a forcefulest team. And we will. We and you will. You are dead. You're gonna die. That's right. You're fucked. We're gonna fucking kill you. Yeah, we're gonna fucking murder you. And this is it. This is the fucking game over situation right here. You're fucking dead and dying tonight. Fuck you. Today, I mean, it's is it not night? It's the fucking day right now. Well, it's night where we live. Well, fuck you. Cheropian, maybe you don't know this about your little pal, Trover, but he used to pee in the sink on purpose. Not like me. I would pee in people's mouths where it's supposed to be. Trover's to pee in the fucking sink? Everyone knows you're supposed to pee in people's mouths. Are you kidding me? It's not that hard. Look or just fucking throw a rock and you'll hit someone. They'll open their mouth and you pee inside of it. Big deal. That's right. That's what the world we lived on was like. And Trover peed in a goddamn sink. Shut the fuck and up. I peed in people's mouths because I'm a fucking... I'm a fucking person of integrity and fuck all of this shit. And if somebody were to take that last quote and put it in print, it wouldn't read as funny as it did when I said it out loud. But I don't care because there's no journalists around. Oh, uh, actually, I'm a clone journalist. I'm working on a story and I'm gonna use that thing you said. Well, I, I don't know what to say about that. God damn, those motherfuckers keep just shit talking. He doesn't close the shower curtain while he showers. You should not close the shower curtain from a stranger from another manger. You're gonna fucking die here, Trover. You're fucking de dead as fuck, Trover. This is the dead end spot of the game for you. You little piece of shit, purple piece of shit. That's racist that you would call me purple. I don't give a fuck, Trover. I'm so excited about something. I'm so excited. Oh, 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 my, oh I'm gonna schlungle. I'm gonna schlungle. Fuck, they killed the last of our clone warriors. What? I signed a contract with you two. You specifically said you'd kill Trover and the Cherorpian. Fuck you. I guess we're gonna have to go down and deal with this. I'll go first. All right, you go first. God damn it. Shut the fuck up, Gale. Fuck you. What the fuck is wrong with those guys? Shut the fuck you up, punk. Oh, you knocked off some of my armor. It's not fair. You're not gonna get the power babies. There's no way we're gonna let you catch these power babies here. You're gonna die. Trover, you know that just because you might be persevering doesn't mean that you're not a cherist. What? What are you talking about, Gail? You always said cherorpians couldn't flip around. And that's why they'd never be in gymnasticals in the super special gymnast alien special Olympics. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Man, I would never. Whoa, easy. There's the truth and then there's other stuff. Goddamn cherist. Trover, you son of a bitch. Good thing I made for a blackout plan. I'm gonna squirt out a bunch of little cube creatures out of these giant cubes that are up here, and they're gonna kill you. Just because those chicken nugget people couldn't do it doesn't mean I can't, Trover. You're fucked. Initiate little tiny cube monsters. Shields down, cube creatures go. That's it, that's all you got, Gil? I'll get that $720, Trover. If it's the last thing I do! Ah, ah, keep going, keep going! You're gonna knock my cubes down, Trova, you're a fucking cherished racist! Oh, ah, you're a racist! Ah. What are you doing? What are you why are you screaming, Gail? Ah, because because I'm 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 defeated! You're Jesus Christ, the fucking gossip mongerist! I mean I mean all this